with the strengths of an aircraft. In July 1936, the Soviet military's main scientific research committee approves a detailed design study for a flying submarine. It is known as the LPL, after the Russian letters for flying submarine aircraft. For flight, the LPL is powered by three conventional piston engines. It carries a crew of three and flies at 150 miles per hour with a range of 500 miles. When the aircraft lands on water, panels close to seal the flight engines. The aircraft is painted with corrosion-resistant materials and it is armed with two 18-inch torpedoes carried under the fuselage. When submerged, the machine has a speed of three knots. The idea was that the flying submarine would be able to penetrate a heavily defended harbor by flying over the mines and the submarine nets, then submerge and attack the battleships and aircraft carriers that thought they were in safety inside the harbor. But the technical challenges prove too much for the Russians, and the flying sub is never completed. 